My name is Colin Schmidt. My name is Carter Stockland. And we worked on the Echo Case Cleaner project for Echo USA. And the scope of our project is that we had to take the choke assembly that Echo brought to us, and we had the four pieces, the shutter choke, the choke lever, the case, and the screw. And we had to automate and design a system that would assemble the entire thing. So if you watch, you'll see the two robots working simultaneously. So the Panic's gonna come and grab the lever. It's gonna place it in, it sends it down. And then from there, the scare is gonna place the case it's grabbed. It's gonna send the case back down. Panic's going to take this piece, place it in, sends it back down here, and then from there, the Scara is going to screw it down. It has a smart torque setting, so when it hits its torque, it'll know that it's good, it picks it up, and then sends it down. And so, as this whole thing is running, we have a Cognix camera integrated with the system. Every time you see it flash, what it's doing is it's, uh, it's taking a picture of the current part, and it's comparing it to a reference image that we made of a completed part. So the whole system knows whether or not the part is good to go, or if it needs to stop and requires operator assistance. Um, some other things, we have these Desteco cylinders that are just, they make sure to hold the parts down throughout the various stages of assembly, uh, just to make sure nothing moves and it's all consistent. Uh, we have a sensor checking the screw to also confirm that that's present. So once it detects presence there, then it allows the screw program to continue. If it doesn't uh, detect the screw, what it'll do is the robot will keep going back to the presenter and trying to grab it, and it'll run a set number of times, and if it doesn't grab one, it'll pause the program.